Hello and welcome to the Sim Hanger. My name's Mark, and in this video, I hope to answer, well, at least in part, a question many of you have been asking, and that is what is going on at Honeycomb Aeronautical? Well, Nikki, the founder of Honeycomb, recently did a fairly lengthy post on Facebook. I'll leave links in the notes below if you want more details. And in this video, I'm just going to summarize some of the major points. We're all aware of particularly over the last two years or so, that communication from that company has been nothing short of abysmal. And I don't think I'm being overdramatic by saying that. There's been pre-orders placed, Charlie Rudder pedals, for example, but nothing has been forthcoming and we've had delay after delay after delay. We've also had, and an important point here, numerous warranty claims that just have not been fulfilled and support, well, there's been very little support and even on the Discord, the Honeycomb Discord admins have been unable to answer questions. Apparently, they say, under an NDA, which is odd anyway. So all of this has created lots of rumour and speculation. Well, perhaps in this video we're going to be able to throw a little bit more light on the situation, but I have to tell you right now it's not all good news. The long and the short of it is Nikki needed a business partner in order to help finance the establishment of Honeycomb. That business partner dealt with the Hong Kong offices and the main factory in Shenzhen. As it turns out, and I have to be careful what I say here, but it appears there's been an element of financial, or it's alleged there's been an element of financial mismanagement, and the factory, in a nutshell, just hasn't been paid for stocks, for work in progress, which is obviously the Charlie rudder pedals, and they have stop supply. Nicky says he was unaware of the severity of the situation until fairly recently and I think has been somewhat naive to allow it to continue for this length of time. Furthermore, in terms of warranty and getting your money back, I noticed, by the way, that the Honeycomb site is down today. Um, whether it'll be down tomorrow, I don't know. But Spotify, they're the... Uh, company that supply merchant services to websites uh, for business transactions such as Honeycomb Aeronautical, well, they found themselves in an invidious situation and as far as I can ascertain, I've pulled the plug as well. So it's a fairly grim situation at the moment. So what does that mean for you? Well, First and foremost, if you are one of those people that has placed a pre-order and prepaid for one of their products, or perhaps you've cancelled an order and waiting for your money back, I would, as a matter of urgency and priority, I would claim that back through your credit card provider, because your chance of getting that money back from Honeycomb, well, I don't think the chances are very good, and Nicky seems to indicate exactly the same thing in his lengthy Facebook post. Now he says he's looking for an alternative business partner because he needs additional financial support and has a number of interested parties. And in addition, he's dealing directly with the factory in Shenzhen now and not going through any third party. However, I think the position is still somewhat precarious. I hope that Nicky is able to restore the company back to health, but the position, as I said, is precarious. And it may be a coincidence, but I noted today that Aerosoft, their European distributors, are offering the Alpha, Bravo and the XPC Alpha at really low prices, prices lower than I've seen for some time. Now that may just be a coincidence, but I'm just saying. I think that it's good that Nicky has come out and at last laid out his table and told us what's going on. However, um, it's inexcusable that it's gone on for this long and we've been kept in the dark for this amount of time. This is information that should have come out a long, long time ago. 
The best case scenario is that Nikki does find, of course, additional funding and is able to meet and honor his commitments. And according to his post, that is his stated intention. The worst case, of course, we can't ignore that. And that's simply that Honeycomb goes the way of the dodo. Sorry to be the bearer of what is potentially bad news, but thank you very much for joining me today. Take care, see you soon, and bye for now.